Hi, okay, so today I wanted to go over my portfolio that I made when I got accepted into RISD, but I can't find my tripod anywhere, so I'm gonna find that before I do anything else, because I don't know where that is right now. Okay, 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 I found, I found my tripod, and this is good, this is good news. Uh, I'm gonna put this down to do this. I gotta, like, set all this up. Okay, cool. Now I gotta slip this into this thing and then BAM! Darn, that's looking pretty good. Oh Jesus, the legs are off balance. Alright. This is good. I gotta test this camera angle right here. Make my lamp thingy here. So what I wanted to do today was go over and this is okay, this is bugging me. Because I just recorded this whole thing and then I realized I had to actually press record button, so I wanna shoot myself right now, but that's it's okay, I'll do it again. I'm gonna go over I got, I got my, my little computer here. Oh, oh Jesus, all right, go back in there. I'm gonna go over today my portfolio that I sent in uh, to Rhode Island, Rhode Island School of Design. What pieces I submitted when I sent in my application. And hopefully, maybe, that'll give you a little bit of perspective as to what they're looking for. I don't know, it might, it might not. This is just what I sent in, and this is what got accepted from me. Also, you may have, you may have noticed just a little Little tidbit, production value has gone up a little bit. I got, got nice lights here. I got my window, my cat sitting there. Uh, I, got, I got a nice natural natural light coming in. Yeah, cool. Okay, we'll start off first piece. This one, this was this one's called Quiet Winter in the Woods. Uh, even though it's not in the woods, it's on a lake, but it doesn't matter. Uh, this was just mostly me practicing my, my, my shading capabilities and my, my perspective and like my background doing. I got really, really lazy in this one, you'll notice uh, like the trees in the background. It's like you got a couple like real trees, but then it just kind of looks like, oh, oh, not too great. You can see I got really lazy. At the top of the, the main tree on the left there, the top of it, I literally just stopped drawing branches. I don't know why. Like, I just wanted to rush and finish it. Put this down. Oh shit, that's too much. God damn. Next one, Pagani Huayra. Okay, this one was graphite for the actual body of the car and the background was done with watercolor. A little bit of the shading was done with watercolor too. Uh, this was mostly just to show that I knew how to like get reflections off of materials, how to, uh, you know, get yeah, like like complex shapes and like different perspectives with complex shapes. Like, like it, it's, it's kind of technically complicated, but it really wasn't like extremely difficult. Like once you get down to it, it's just kind of like, you know, can you do some relatively basic stuff? Uh, okay. It was also graphite and watercolor. This one took me, I don't even know how much time, it doesn't even, doesn't matter how long it took you. I kind of rushed this one though, and you can see that everything in this is, 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 is lacking detail. It's lacking any kind of depth to it. It's just very surface. This was just a test of my own, uh, like, composition abilities, which have improved a bit since then, but still, they're not incredibly great. I gotta work on that still, that's something I'm still working on. But this, you can see like there's a lot of stuff, like a lot of little pieces that are wrong. Uh, this one was to show shading on like complex shapes and whatnot. Kind of similar to the to the, the car that I drew, but this one was a little bit different, a little bit simpler than that one. Uh, the, the shading on the, I liked the shading on this one. It turned out pretty good. Uh, I need to get better at blending. That's one thing. I need to definitely get better with blending. Uh, other than that, I think the perspective was relatively fine on it. Uh, this one, unsolved puzzle, also just showing unique shapes on with, with, with shading, what I can do with it. Uh, there were a lot of pieces of this that I messed up, honestly. Like, take for example, like the piece all the way on the right, that square. That one, like, you shouldn't be able to see that far inward on it, but I didn't realize that as I was actually doing it, because I don't think I was looking at my reference when I did the inside of the pieces, which that, that's that's on me. Uh, okay, uh, but again, uh, just kind of basic shading, not too bad. Old Farmer, this one took, this was my first, like, like real digital painting. This was like, like the first one that I spent more than like an hour on this. This took me like four hours to do it, and this was like, okay, take for example the grass, okay, in the bottom left. I literally drew like a chunk of the grass and then like copied and pasted it down the entire thing and like just added little variations to it along the way. 
it was just like like I, like I cheated really bad on it. The clouds, you'll see, like I don't even know what I was trying to do with those. It was, uh, like I feel like if I redrew that now, it would look a lot better than it did then. Uh, okay, next one. Downtown Boston. This one, I do like this one because I feel like I got the the, the shading and the colors really good on it. But I also got really lazy. Like the clouds, you can just by looking at it, like immediately you'll notice like. It's 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 lazy the, the way that I shaded those clouds. Uh, the cars in the bottom, I like airbrushed the hell out of them because I didn't want to get like I, I was trying to avoid very sharp edges because I didn't really know what I was doing with the edges and whatnot. It was it was overall it was just not. Uh, next one, dark sky rise. This one was just me just playing around with three point perspective, just me trying to get like a, like a basic idea because this was the first time I'd ever done like 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 real three point perspective like. A completely like not off of a reference photo, you know, like that, all that stuff. Uh, the little selective color that I added, I don't know how I feel about that. I feel like like it kind of turned out good, but it kind of also didn't. Next one, abstract nonsense. I also kind of cheated at this one. The blue was not in the original piece. I added that in after the fact in Photoshop because I liked how it looked. Uh, this was done with Sharpies and watercolor. But I grayscaled the image after I was done, then added the blue in synthetically afterwards. This one, for our own purpose, this was before I knew how to draw trees, okay? This is just kind of, I mean, I'm still not great with trees, especially trees with like leaves. Like, like you can see like in the one, like, like the old farm road that I did, like the leaves were just like little swooshes. I, I tried, because, because doing that digitally is easy, because you can change the brush thickness depending on how hard you press. But with something like this, it's very different. It's, it's, it's harder to do that, especially with graphite. This was just, was, yeah, this was just graphite. This was for one of the prompts. They had us do the prompt was like, uh, show, uh, show like deconstruction of something. Or, and, I, and I showed like the deconstruction of trees, like like some like sappy bullshit like that. It was like, oh, deconstruction of, of trees is, uh, is, is fueling our, uh, our, our, our shit. Oh, ooh. It was more about the, the concept than the actual execution of it. This one, Sinking Below the Horizon. This was my first ever full uh, full watercolor piece. Uh, this was like, like I, I rushed this bad. I think this only took me like 20 minutes. It was really like, like I really should have spent more time on it. This was just to show, again, it's good to show that you can do multiple forms of media. Like I wanted to show, oh yeah, by the way, I'm like okay with watercolor, like, actually okay is a strong word, but you know what I'm saying. Uh, percussion, this one's old, this is an old, old drawing, this was back from like sophomore year or something, I think this was old as hell, but like there's no background, there's nothing, it's just kind of showing like percussion, because I've, be I've been a percussionist my entire life, I've been playing the drums since I can remember, and it was just to kind of include that. Uh, this one, okay, better expression. Also, because you have to make, for, for the prompts, you have to make two responses to the prompt, and this was the second one. This was like the deconstruction of the mind of an artist, man. It was all like, like, like poetic and emotional and shit, and it was like, oh man, you try to deconstruct the mind of an artist, you're gonna, you're gonna have a bad time, because you, because, well, you're not ready for that, buddy boy. Uh, that was pretty much it. And then... I forget whether or not I put this one in there, but I'm gonna include it in this too. Uh, this one, a fallen vase. This was I just kind of started doodling around with like foliage and stuff, and then I'm like, oh, okay, it looks good. And then I added the vase and the window in the background and everything, and I added, I made it look all nice. Okay, well, nice. In actuality, it's just kind of like like a very rough background, like friggin' lines don't even line up with each other. Whatever, it doesn't even matter. It's just to have something there, so it wasn't just white space. And, uh, I think that's it. Right now, today's like February something. Hold on, did I find my phone? Okay, today is February 14th. And I already have, for next year, I have my roommate, I have my room assignment. Uh, I don't know what I'm gonna be majoring in, honestly. Uh, and again, I'm gonna keep making, or at least I'm gonna try to keep making videos throughout the time that like like I, I get there, I can explain what's happening, what's going on. I know there are a couple other people on YouTube who have done that at RISD, but I'm gonna try to like put my two cents in. Okay, cool. Alright, I'm gonna I'm gonna end this now. You can enjoy a little uh a little, little 
video of my cat to, to, to play you on out here with the credits.